Six down, three to go. Good morning, afternoon, or evening. I'm your host, Alston. When I last left you, we had the Wolf Chapel completed, except for a few flashes I've missed around here, and a bishop that I did not expect to be there. I totally did not expect that to be there. I'm out of here, man. <laughs> okay, so we have the three in Wolf, the two in Griffin, and the one in Dragon. So for now, let's go to Griffin and hit the final switch. We're back here again, and the Afrits are back too. They climbed up from the fire pit down that way, it looks like. So let's save the game and get them out of the way the best we can. Knock them back a little bit still. Uh, trying to use the disc of repulsion, but it's not seeming to work. Okay, they're real pain to hit with the hammer. But I'm gonna try anyway. I just jerked and missed. There's still one more, but that's okay. Alright. Save some flashes for here. Because there are chaos serpents down there. I'm trying to make sure I get rid of them. I don't want to run and have to axe down here, but I think I might do that. Around the corner. Definitely save before I do. Strafe out. Watch out for the Afrits. Three. Got him. Ooh, right in Afrit fire. And I wasted a quartz flask right there. No, 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 no. And then that stuck serpent on the stairs is giving me fits, too. Ah, okay. Actually, I want to check something out here. Oh, yeah, yeah. He, uh, he's real. For now, I'm going to step over here and look up on this platform. Now, the last time I tried playing this, I want to debate and see if it would be worth using my crater right here. And ultimately, I hate it because you want to save those for when you really need them. I feel like I could kite around or move around these bishops around the edge there. Man, I'm so low on mana, it's just... We'll do it. What do you think? If you're playing, what would you do there? Go ahead and use the crater or maybe try to stick it out. Either approach would work, you just have to be careful. This helps a lot though, being able to do this this way. Because those things go around the corners. If you watch their fireballs go around the corners. Alright. That makes it really hard. Okay, one ninth of the puzzle has been solved on the monastery. Let's save this here. This window is a little tricky to break. Maybe it's a Z-Doom thing, maybe not. I don't know. But you want to... I don't know. I thought you aimed at the head to try to break it. I have some issues. I tried it before and I got it, you know, four times. Oh, two! All right! I, even better. I'm saving after that. Actually, I'm going to try something here. Watch this. Go! That was fun. All right. Get this wall to open. Come down. Reveal a porculator with three crystal vials. So we stepped on this portal, or rather, platform, and triggered the third switch. I forgot about this last time. Boom, surprise Slaughtars. Actually, uh, <laughs> didn't make it last time I tried this. And now I remember they're there. Caught me off guard, like I said last time. Afrits too. basically everything just opens up here. You can get a falcon shield, some mana, and another Slaughtar whenever you step into here. You really have to watch out now. But, on the plus side, that's it for Griffin Chapel. Don't want to forget about this elevator here. It takes you up, grab the quartz flask, and back down, grab the flashes. Another Etten up there, I'm not worried about him. Four crystal vials for later. And we're finished here. On to Dragon Chapel for the final two switches. And the first step I'm going to make is off to the right. So knock these out. Remember these little crusher things? Well, they are actually moved back now. So when you walk through, you don't get crushed. Super handy. Actually, you can finish, finish the puzzles with those being out of your way now. Remember that for later. You come over here and you hit this uh, elevator type thing. Yeah, it has an Edson on it. Just go ahead and knock him out and Get on, wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. Takes you to the top. This is why I wanted to have all of the stuff knocked out before, because you remember there's Slaughtars on there, on those little middle platforms. But now they're gone. There's Bishop, let's see if I can snipe him out. Yes. Open this door that doesn't really look like a door. It's kind of vague, isn't it? 
but it, it was a door nonetheless. Come up and over, hear the bishops. Hit this switch, you come back down. Now you can go back down the elevator, but I want to get those flashes over there. Actually, I can jump back. Yeah, why not? See if I can jump back. Whoa. There we go. Like, go back down? Maybe not. Over, around, and look. Crater of Might spawns in there. Awesome. Okay, a couple Etsons I want to get rid of so they don't get in my way later. Come down and over, and look. This is open. Uh, Etons. Alright. You remember earlier we were down in the swamp pit, right? And there were a bunch of stalkers and dark bishops and lots of trouble. Well, now we are on the other side of that, which is really neat. Come on, got it. Okay, Quartz Flask Galore. One ninth of the puzzle has been solved on the monastery. One ninth of the puzzle, and that's almost it. We just have one more switch to do, and we're finished here. Come on. Get the axe or a little quicker. Do it that way. Bring the elevator down here. Head in. You can also run back out to the main area. What we're doing now is also just getting the extra little odds and ends. Nothing big. Actually, there's not much to get up here, is there? Huh. Not really. You can go ahead and do it this way. Run up here. It's actually doing it backwards, though. Oh, fell off. It's okay, you can come back this way again. Oop. This is where we were. Okay. Before I accidentally fell off. Here we go. We've already gotten everything. Okay, cool. So let's go back here. Let's go this way since we haven't been here before. And see these guys. Just centaurs. So that's good. Give me on the no, I missed the elevator. You hear that crunch? Gibbed him. He was gibbed. Alright. Here. Come on. A little faster now. Alright, top of this elevator. Bunch of green mana. So I'm gonna go ahead and use it. Look out. You step over there. You, if you step off, it triggers it too, but that's a little more dangerous that way. You ready? One ninth of the puzzle, thereby finishing the puzzle, has been solved on the monastery. That's it. I'm gonna go ahead and just four kicks come over here, finish it out. We've done pretty much everything we can here. All the items are collected too, which is nice. But really, over here, it's just uh, extra monsters, a little bit of mana, it's nothing you really need. This opens up behind you, so you have to watch out there too. Come on. Oh, man. I need to get some uh, health here, don't I? Whoa, forgot about him. Try to run past, that didn't work. Okay. More flashes, this is good. Since flashes and discs don't count as items. Jump up on here. Okay, so there are quartz, or rather crystal vials around the area here. Hmm. I don't need those. Am I full of flashes? No, I'm not. I missed one. Let's see if I can do this. Get ready. Go. Nice. It worked. I need to remember where those crystal vials are. I can't remember though, and I, I, I trust me, I really do need them right now. So I'll scare. Whoa! We actually, have all the enemies dead too. We have a hundred percent of this map. That's pretty cool. All right, we'll get those two. Call that there. Try to make another run jump. Nope. No good. All right. That is it. That's all the switches we can go back for the final part of the hub. Take one more quick scan through. Here's a couple things we need. That'll do it for us. All right, heading back to the plane one. See, this takes you to the other two and this takes you back to the start. Check it out. All nine have lit up. This can only mean one thing. Next time we take on a boss battle, the Heresiarch. This one is tougher than the last one, I will tell you that. So be sure to stick around for me next time when I battle the Heresiarch. Like the video if you like the video. Like the video if you like the video and you support it. I do appreciate it. And subscribe if you want to be notified when the Heresiarch battle's coming. I will see you next time when I take this guy out.